you're going to have classes that are going to be easy and you're going to have classes that are going to be hard and there's always the weed out classes that are going to push you but you're going to get a really good education. When it comes to taking classes, probably the best thing for you is getting to know your teachers and making sure your teachers know who you are. Because the closer your relationship is with your teachers, the easier it is for you to go and ask them questions. And the easier that is for you, the easier it is for you to learn in your classes. And it helps you understand how your teacher is thinking and why they, you know, why they sign particular assignments and stuff like that. So your teachers are your biggest allies when it comes to learning. I think one of the most important things is to have a positive attitude. If you can do that, you can pretty much overcome anything. If you have a hard class that's requiring you to stay up every night, you're only getting three hours of sleep a night for the whole week and you get pretty dog tired and you need that extra bit of energy, I mean, having a positive attitude will definitely get you a long way. In the beginning, it's going to be kind of tough, but after you get over that mountain, it's, it's really nice. You, you realize how everything comes together and why, you're, why you actually studied all that stuff in the beginning. It, in the beginning, it kind of seems like, well, I don't understand what this is for. I don't, what's the purpose of, of, of all this? But when, it, when you get closer to the end, you'll see. You'll see why you learned all the stuff you learned. Don't be scared. Don't be scared of math. I think um, everybody, or anybody who's thinking of doing an engineering, the, my biggest concern was like, well, I, I'm good or mad, but what if I'm not that good? What if I'm not that good at calculus or differential equations or physics, all the other stuff? No, there's help out there. Everybody's scared and you'll find friends that will help you and professors that would stay there all night with you doing homework, tutoring you. And that's, don't be scared of math. That's that we tell everybody because it's easy. Um. What kind of advice would I give to a prospective engineering student? If you're still in high school, take as much math as you can before you get out. If you are interested in math and science and making things, <laughs> I, I highly recommend trying out engineering. Uh, the whole walking onto a college campus and figuring out if it's right for you, I mean, that, that was scary for me, and I know it's, it's not a, it puts you out of your comfort zone. But the more and more you do it, the more and more you might find that one college that you walk on campus and you're just not scared, you feel right about it. And When I came down to visit the state, I actually visited three times. And because I felt comfortable, I was like, hey, you know, I think I'm gonna go to that college. So go out and visit them and don't be afraid. It's, I know it's the next big step, but you know, go ahead and take it because it's, it's great.